So I just had a guy tell me that the economy is booming and that the only reason people are struggling is because they're not working hard enough. Yep, so for all of us struggling, we're just not working hard enough. Does this guy realize that today there are people who are making thirty to fifty thousand more dollars a year than they than they were making three to five years ago, but they are struggling more today than three to five years ago? Has this guy walked through a grocery store? Has he seen the price of chips? Has he seen the price of cereal? Has he seen the prices of anything? Does he realize that we have elderly who, in order to put food on the table, are having to go work at Walmart even though they're 80 years old? Does he realize that people who are in their 30s and 40s who do have a job, who do have a good career, have moved back in with their parents because they can't afford the price of rent and they can't buy a home right now because the interest rates are so high and the prices of homes are still high? And then you add on property taxes and then you add on home insurance. People can't afford that. And it's not as simple as go get a better job, go get a second job. It's not that simple. Telling a mom like me to go get a second job when I'm already working a full-time career and I already have a two hour commute every day, I don't have time for that. Okay, so what? I go get a second job and now I'm never with my children? How is that worth it? Oh, and now I have to go pay more daycare expenses? How is that worth it? Okay, we have a lot of people in this country, in this world, struggling, and the answer is not to bury your hand in the head in the sand and act like nothing's going on. Do not tell me the economy is booming. The economy is not booming when people are struggling the way they are. And I, when I mean people, I mean people that have good jobs, who have good degrees, who have two incomes coming in their house, and the family is still struggling. That's not a booming economy.